guys, I hope you're keeping well. If you're new here, my name is Kanye and welcome to my channel. I mean, this thing is always running. It's always almost running you over all the time. Ooh, this looks nice over here. Everyone's filming at this mall. I've seen all the videos online. You cannot stop me now. <laughs> This is really gonna test me. Yes, it is. You you agree with me? Today I'm at a suburb called Four Ways in Johannesburg, and I'm going to be taking you through the biggest mall in South Africa. All right, guys. I wasn't sure how to start this video and where to start this video because I'm not familiar with this mall. So I parked and went into the mall trying to find a spot to start the video. And then I found myself outside here. This is like a mini golf um, area here. Just outside the mall. It is part of the mall itself. Other than just being a mall with shops and restaurants, this is um, an entertainment and leisure center. So there are other activities that you can do here other than shopping and mini golf is one of them. Right, I can't go down, but that is the mini golf. It's a, there are three nine hole golf courses as far as I know and then next door here is Altitude Beach this is a club and a restaurant I'm sure I'll be allowed inside <laughs> can I go inside and look quickly <laughs> thank you oh they have a big screen here This looks like so much fun. <laughs> Even the adults have fun here, you guys. This is the food court. Definitely the food court. <laughs> I can just smell food all over. Oh yeah, this is the food court. Pizza, McDonald's. There's always a KFC. And our version of KFC, chicken licking. Um, escalator that way. I wonder if I should go up or continue on straight. <laughs> Guys, I am winging it here. Oh no, 
up. It looks like it's the end here. Let me go back. Let me go upstairs. See what's happening there. Okay, they have some directions here. Guys, one of the things that I haven't seen in this mall yet is one of those electronic directories that you can use to find where you are and where certain shops are. Not that I know how to use one because I don't know how to read any map. But I haven't seen one here, which is very strange for such a big mall. But there are these boards uh, where you can kind of figure out where you are. Right now, I'm at the lower food court. And moving up to the upper food court. So there are two food courts. There's a lower and upper. This is the biggest food court that I know of or I've ever seen in any mall in South Africa. It's two levels, so a very wide selection when it comes to food here. Yeah? This is where I am, where Bounce is and Adventure Golf was. And now I'll move on to the upper food court. And then still one level up would be the lower mall. guys like I said I don't know how to read a map but I think I could do with one around about now because <laughs> I got no idea where I am so in terms of the number of shops here there are a little over 350 shops and over 8,000 parking bays I hope I remember where I parked my car because I've lost my car before at the airport <laughs> so yeah it's really big guys that's the low food court from the... What level is this again? I can't even remember what level I said this was. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> oh, this is the upper food court. So that's what this level is called. Oh, here's something I haven't tried that I've been wanting to try for a long time. Philly cheesesteak. Apparently they're amazing. That's something for another day. Okay, let me go up to the next level. And just on another note, this wall is not new. It's about 23 years old. But then it was extended in 2019. And that's when it became the biggest mall in South Africa. Otherwise, before, the, before then, it was just an average mall. Oh gosh, where to go, where to go? Let me go this way. I don't have a clue. I don't know this mall. And that's the thing about really big malls. The idea of them is amazing, like having so many shops. I remember going to Dubai back like some years ago, my first time in Dubai, and the only time I've ever been to Dubai. And of course, the big thing there was going to the Mall of Dubai. At that time, it was the biggest mall in the world. I think now it's changed. It's another mall in China that's now biggest, the biggest mall in the world. But <laughs> I mean, walking through there was just so overwhelming. You don't even know where to start, which shop to go into. Oh, okay. What's this here? Oh, this is the exhibition court. So this exhibition space is open to rent, to hire for the day. Very big space. All right, guys, next stop. I think I'll go one level up again. This is an even better view up here. doing over there guys I don't know this mall very well so I'm just 
I'm literally gonna wing it. <laughs> In fact, I don't know it at all. I've been here once before, a very long time ago, but I'm very unfamiliar with this mall. Shops, shops, and more shops. <laughs> Guys, I'm not gonna go inside any of the shops because, I mean, it's clothing shops. <laughs> It's closed. Super dry. What you will find in this mall are shops that are a little unusual that you won't find at the other malls. So that's another thing that makes this one different. You've got your usual chain stores, but there are other shops that you like. Okay, I've never seen that shop before. You go this way. Game court. Ooh, this looks nice over here. Wow, guys. Look at the ceiling. Oh. This is a gorgeous ceiling. This mall seems very quiet. It's a Saturday today and it's the end of the month, so Normally malls would be very busy, but I think also due to the size of this mall, it looks like it's very sparse when it comes to the people that are in here. But um, all these shops have to be making money. I don't think they'd be here if they were not making money. <laughs> but that being said, you guys, I don't know what it's like in other countries, but the economic situation here, things have just gone crazy. The cost of food, just the cost of living in general. <sighs> that lady behind me, I think she's security. Was, she was trying to stop me from filming. I said, everyone's filming at this mall. I've seen all the videos online. <laughs> you cannot stop me now. <laughs> what a lovely person. Okay, what is here? Game court. Toy stores here. Hamleys! Hamleys is the oldest toy store in the world. It was established in 1760 in London, England, and now they have stores all over the world and of course South Africa as well. Guys, I wish it was a child. This is such a lovely shop. Let me see if they'll let me in. Stream. Okay, strangely, there are no kids in this toy store. <laughs> Guys, the cost of living is crazy out here. <laughs> Puzzles. Oh, Legos. Guys, Legos will never go out of fashion, ever. I don't see any prices on this, these Legos. I'm sure they cost an arm and a leg. I mean, look at this one. Oh my word. This is on special. Was 1.6, now 1.36. 9 to 14 year olds. I mean, to buy something like this for a child. Okay, 9 to 14 years old. They're pretty big, so they won't bash the thing immediately or lose the pieces immediately. Sure. Let me see what dolls cost. Where are the dolls here? Oh, this is like a play area. This looks like fun. Okay, that's the Hamley's Play Park. Parents are over there having a drink. <laughs> I want to see what dolls cost. Where are the dolls? I can't see Barbie or anything here. Just Barbie. Oh, okay, there's Barbie. I want to see what a Barbie cost costs now. Okay, all these are Barbie. 
Do you want to sleep first? Yeah. In the back. Okay. She's two, two fifty. Oh, that's okay. Two fifty though. Yeah. What, is it too high? <laughs> it's actually okay. It's not as bad as I thought it would be oh, yeah. for Barbie. Um, for Barbie. Yeah. Yeah. Two fifty is actually actually okay. <laughs> I suppose this is Ken over here. <laughs> How much is Ken? Oh, five, seven, nine. Okay, he's got some accessories, so. <laughs> Guys, when I was a child, I used to dream of having a Barbie. I used to get a cheap version of Barbie, but not Barbie, the real Barbie. <laughs> All right, guys, that's enough of Hamleys. It's so quiet that even this Hamleys train is parked. I mean, this thing is always running at Santon City. It's always almost running you over all the time. But here it is parked on a Saturday. No kids for the train. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm not sure what's next. I'll go up this elevator. And then that will be the last section I'm going to look at. Guys, I found one of the directory screens. This is the only one I've seen in this mall. So I know there's a go-karting uh, ring here, but I've asked so many people and nobody knows where it is. So I'm going to see if I can find it using this directory. Okay. Search. I'm gonna type cart. Okay, so it is here. Extreme indoor karting. Shop NG77. Okay, I'm close to it here. I'm seeing where Disc Kim is. Toy Kingdom is right here. Okay, straight, turn left, and it's somewhere around there. Guys, this is really gonna test me. Okay, let me try and find it because I am close. But the funny thing is, I've asked security <laughs> twice and nobody has been able to tell me where this thing is. Right, this is the desk cam. I'm going to try going downstairs. It might be downstairs. It has to be on the ground floor. That's something that would be on the ground floor. Okay guys, I've asked another person. It seems the go-karting is outside the mall. So most likely in the area around where the mini golf is. So I'm back at the food court area. I just want to show you, you guys. And then I'm going to close off this video. I'm in the car park. <laughs> the mission is still to find the extreme go-karting. Oh my gosh. This is how you know I really don't know how to read a map. Okay. Apparently I must take the lift to the fifth floor. <laughs> oh no. And the interesting thing is, I'm looking at the sign here and there's no fifth floor. There's level 4 to 7, and then there's level 3. There's no fifth floor. This is a disaster. I'm lost. <laughs> I'm looking for the go-karting place. Someone told me the fifth floor, but there's no fifth floor here. 4 to 7, level 7. Okay. Oh, okay. It's between 4 and 7. Okay. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the mission on a mission to find the go-karting. Good luck. And now this elevator is confusing. The whole place is confusing. Small is something else. Okay, this is mine. Okay, do I go okay, let me go this way. <laughs> Cheers guys. Ah. 
guys I have <laughs> I've walked this entire mall and finally I find the extreme indoor go-karting place it's actually on level four okay that's it right next to the parking on level four oh, I, what a mission you guys Hi, how are you? How are you? I'm good, thanks. I just want to see inside. It's so hard to find this place. <laughs> yes, it is. You, you agree with me? Definitely. Alright guys, I'm going to give you a quick view of the go-karting track that is impossible to find. And funny enough, the guy at reception says, yes, it is very difficult to find. Okay, then put up some signage or something. Okay, these are the cars. Over here, it's just a place to relax, chill. Alright, so this is just a car park that they've turned into a track. Thank you. I'm gonna have you on camera now. By force. So you worked in with the car? Yeah, I did. It's fine. I just want to take a quick shot of the inside of the track. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. Cheers. Bye. I'm going to try and find the entrance I came in. That's my next challenge. All right, folks, that is it. That is Four Ways Mall, the biggest mall in South Africa. And I can attest to that it is huge. Thanks for watching you guys and I will see you on the next one. <laughs>